So kidney cancer is one of the top 10 most common malignancies in the United States. Uh, this year it's estimated that over 60,000 cases will be diagnosed. Kidney cancer risk factors uh, include age over 60, uh, the most common patients are in their 60s or their 70s, uh, obesity and smoking, which are all very common risk factors for other malignancies as well. So patients with kidney cancer often will present with blood in their urine, and that is the most reliable early sign of a kidney tumor and should always be investigated um, with your doctor. Uh, other signs of kidney cancer include pain over the kidney or a bulge over the kidney area or abdomen, weight loss, cough. Um, however, these, la these last symptoms are usually signs of more advanced disease. When a patient comes to me with a diagnosis of kidney cancer, the number one question is, is it curable? And the answer is yes, so long as it's still clinically localized and it has not spread to other organs or other parts of the body. And in cases where the tumor is still small enough, we can preserve the kidney by taking out just the tumor. Uh, there are several ways of doing that. Um, one is by doing an open partial nephrectomy, which is done through a incision to the patient's side, which is about 10 inches long, sometimes a little bit smaller. Um, it works very well, however, there's significant morbidity associated with this and significant pain. Uh, so nowadays, the cutting edge treatment for a localized kidney tumor is a robotic partial nephrectomy. Uh, this allows the surgeon to use the laparoscopic technique through very small incisions and therefore pre prevent the morbidity of a large open incision for the patient while getting the tumor out of the kidney uh, with the same measure of cancer control. Now, not every patient is a candidate for partial nephrectomy or for robotic partial nephrectomy. Uh, the ideal candidate has a tumor which is still relatively small and which is not located in the middle of the kidney. Uh, that allows us to reconstruct the kidney in a way that, that preserves good kidney function and in, in which is safe for the patient. With robotic partial nephrectomy, for cancers which are small enough, the cure rate defined as five years without any recurrence of disease is anywhere from 80 to 90 percent. So it's very effective. One alternative for the treatment of kidney cancer is called ablation, and that is either freezing or uh, heating a tumor until it is no longer viable. Uh, that is um, done usually as an outpatient, however, it's only appropriate for very small tumors. Uh, it also carries a slightly higher risk of recurrence than removing the tumor, and that's why in most healthy patients who can tolerate surgery, I recommend removal of the tumor itself using a robotic partial nephrectomy. The surgery itself is performed through several small incisions, uh, which are each about the width of a finger. And through these small incisions, we're able to pass a high definition camera, as well as three different robotic arms, which control instruments that have full hand and wrist movement to, to allow very precise dissection and removal of the tumor. Patients often ask about how much control the surgeon has over the robot during the surgery, and the, the answer to that question is full control. Uh, the robot does exactly what I do with my hands and it just allows me to, in effect, miniaturize my hands into the patient's abdomen and perform a more precise operation. After the surgery, patients are generally in hospital for one or two nights. Uh, by the first day postoperatively, they're walking, uh, they're eating and drinking, and their, their pain is controlled on, or on pain pills. Uh, once they get home, they're able to perform light activity, uh, walking is fine, light chores around the house, uh, and most patients are back to their full activity within three to four weeks. People often ask me why I chose to go into urology and specifically urologic oncology, and I, I always tell them the same thing, which is that to be able to cure somebody of, of a cancer such as kidney cancer or prostate cancer with a state-of-the-art surgical technique which allows them to return to their normal lives quickly and with good function is, is one of the most rewarding things that a doctor can do. Um, it's, it's very enjoyable. <laughs>